similar things about LA. 
your manicure is literally all we need to tell what kind of drunk you get. No, I don't believe it. This is another one of those stories that they just completely make up with absolutely no science behind it, no nothing, in my opinion. Alright, so if you YouTube, you for 
course, allow your friends to watch as you talk and beauty blend. If they call you out for multitasking, you just tell them to take notes. Does anyone do that? Truthfully. I mean, that is serious multitasking. Even if you're not a hair 
accessory person, you're gonna become a hair accessory person. So, I guess what these are is just really, really thick headbands, and they call it a headband. Because you put it on like a hat, because it kind of sits on top of your head more than becoming part of your hair, I guess. Do we like them? That probably depends on the pattern, you know? Interview outfits are stupid. Time for cute outfits that get you hired. Beware of this. It all depends on the job. Let's be real. I really think you should be careful wearing something super funky or, you know, overly colorful when you go to an interview because you don't know what you're walking into. I would say try to keep it real basic, you know, professional looking. Unless, you know, you're going to some place that you know is just really, you know, trendy. And beware, don't wear perfume to a interview unless it's for a perfume place because a lot of times people won't like your perfume or they're allergic to perfume. So yeah, don't wear perfume. Gave me 
Shadow. 